having a midlife crisis, guys. Uh, I've come to accept that. Um, I'm 40 years old. I'm divorced, and I live back home with my parents. Yeah. It's like a double-wide mental hospital. <laughs> oh, it, it, it's, it, 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 it's horrible. I, I mean, I don't, know how to, I don't know how else to explain it. This is not where I expected to be when I was 40 years old. <laughs> Shit happens, what can I say? Oh, man. And me and my mom have a lot in common. You know, I hate to admit that. You know, we both look a lot like my grandfather. We both have documented mental health issues. <laughs> and neither one of us has a filter from our mind to our mouth. You ever been around people like that? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> my, my mom once told me she was an optimist after a suicide speech. <laughs> I looked at her and went, Mom, just because you see the pill bottle is half full does not mean you're an optimist. <laughs> <laughs> she said, just because you're an asshole, Chris, don't make you a comedian. <laughs> My dad said, imagine that shit. <laughs> Hearing both y'all talk made me want to drink. 